वेलकम टू मैथ सोसाइटी नाउ वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट मल्टीप्लीकेशन ऑफ टू मेट्रिस बट बिफोर गोइंग टू द मल्टीप्लीकेशन ऑफ द मेट्रिक्स लेट ए बी अ मेट्रिक विच इज इन दिस फॉर्म ए मेट्रिक्स इज अ फॉर्मेशन ऑफ अ कलेक्शन ऑफ द रियल नंबर इन क्लोज इन अ ब्रैकेट एंड द एंट्रीज रेप्रेजेंटेड इन अरिजोंटल वे इज कॉल्ड अ रो एज द एंट्रीज इन अरिजोंटल वे is rows and the entries within the vertical term is the columns in this matrix there is a two rows and two columns as number of rows and number of columns specifies the order of the matrix so the order of the matrix a is row by column so in this matrix how many rows they are two rows and two columns so let we have another matrix which is a b matrix 1 over 2 matrix order of b matrix which is 2 by 1 we have to find the multiplication of these two matrices basically we have to find this result but here is a very big question in our mind that these two matrices are multiplied or not and what is the condition that these two matrices are multiplied so here is a condition so the condition of the matrices of multiplication is that matrices are comfortable for multiplication if the column of the first matrix which is equals to row of the second matrix which is a matrix b to check out that these two matrices are multiplied or not so the column of the first matrix is equals to the row of the second matrix as we have a order of the a matrix is 2 by 2 and the order of the b matrix which is 2 by 1 so if these two are same then the matrices are multiplied and these two are the order of the order of final matrix we have to find ab this as 5 3 6 2 and multiply with 1 2 as to check the condition are satisfied so we have to multiply this it says that always remember the rule which is rc multiply row with the column so this row multiply by this column so it will be 5 into 1 plus 3 into 2 now multiply this row with this column it will be 6 into 1 plus multiply 2 by 2 so what is our final matrix is 5 plus 3 to the 6 6 plus 4 which is equals to 11 10 so it's a final matrix when these two matrices are multiplied and the order of the final matrix is two rows and one column two by one order now we have to multiply these two matrices so first of all check out the order of these two matrices the order says row by column so in this matrix there is 1 2 3 3 rows and 1 2 2, 2 columns and in this matrix there is 1 2 2, 2 rows and 1 2 2, 2 columns so as these two are same so the multiplication of these two matrices are possible so let's start so for for multiplication we always remember our rule which is rc rule multiply row with column let us take this row with this column so it will be 2 by 2 the sign is plus 3 multiply by 3 now fix this row and change this column so multiply this row with this column so 2 into minus 1 the sign is plus 3 into 0 now to the next row which is this row and multiply with this column 
so 1 into 2 plus 1 into 3 now again fix this row and move this column so it will be 1 into minus 1 plus 1 into 0 now move to another row and multiply with this column so 0 into 2 plus minus 2 into 3 now fix this row and move this column as 0 into minus 1 plus minus 2 into 0. So now just simplify this. 4 plus 9, 2 plus 3, 0 minus 6. It will be minus 2 plus 0, minus 1 plus 0 and 0 minus 0. It will be 13. It will be 5 minus 6. And in this column we are left with minus 2, minus 1 and 0. So here is a final metric. As in the third example we also calculate the product of these two matrices. This is the matrix A and this is the matrix B. As this matrix is 3 rows and 2 columns. 3 by 2. So the order of this matrix is 3 by 2. And the order of this matrix as there is one row and one two three three columns column of the first matrix is not equals to the row of the second matrix so as the condition of the multiplication of two matrices are not satisfied so the multiplication is not possible in that case so it's the last example of today's lecture about multiplication of matrices as there are two matrices and we have to compute the product of these two matrices. So first of all check out the condition that these two matrices are multiplied or not. There is a one row and three columns. So the order of the matrix is one by three. Now check out the order of this matrix. Here is one, two, 3 rows by 1, 2, 2 columns. So the column of the first matrix which is equal to the row of the second matrix. So the multiplication of these two matrices are possible. So now start for the multiplication. Always remember our rule which is RC. Uh, multiply this row with the first column of the second matrix. So it will be 3 into 1 plus 0 into 4 plus 1 into 2. Now multiply with this row, fix this row and this column. So it will be 3 into 2 plus 0 into 3 plus 1 into 0. As write this factor as in this form as I have no space so I, uh, so I write in this way. So now for calculation 3 plus 0 plus 2 and in this form I have 6 plus 0 plus 0 basically which is 3 plus 2 which is 5 and it will be a 6. So here is the final matrix when these two matrices are multiplied. So 1 by 2, 1 by 2 is a final order of the matrix. All about the matrix multiplication. So if you like this then don't forget to subscribe, like and share.